following video contains scenes in which two grown adults are posing as middle school students. Though they are wearing hats, the AM and the AM team wants you to know that school dress code should still be followed. Additionally, as a National Board Certified Teacher and a current SSMS Teacher of the Year, Mrs. Trenholm would never allow a dress code violation in a normal school or classroom setting. Hi, I'm Mr. Danwitz. And I'm Mr. Miro. And we're here for AM and the AM. A few words of wisdom for your student expectations. This week's action is respect others. What are some ways that we can respect others here at school, Mr. Miro? That's a great question, Mr. Adamowitz. A couple of ways you can show respect to others are holding and opening the door for other students, teachers, and staff respecting others by not being rude at lunch or within your classroom, as well as helping your teachers inside the classroom. One way you can show respect this week is by helping out your teachers when they ask for it. For example, uh, Ricky, you know where guidance is? Yes. Can you take Dewan down to guidance? Who's Dewan? The one's right here. Yes, I can take him. Thank you. That is great using of uh, your storm procedures. <laughs> I need a student to go and click something for me. Your assignment for this week is with your class, write down three ways you and your classmates can show respect to one another and students around the school. You won't need to write it on a piece of paper, but just have your teacher write it on the board as a reminder to keep you all accountable. I'm Mr. Danwitz. And I'm Mr. Miro. And we'd like to thank you on behalf of AM and the AM for watching today. Make it a great day. Or not. The choice is yours. yours.